Hi everyone, it's Mrs. Wolf. Today we're going to learn how to count dimes and pennies and use place value to help us. This is a dime. A dime has two sides and it's worth 10 cents. On one side, there's a picture of a torch. It also has the words one dime. On the other side, there's a picture of President Roosevelt. A penny also has two sides. It's worth one cent. On one side, there's a picture of the Lincoln Memorial. It's a type of building, and it also has the words one cent. The other side has a picture of President Abraham Lincoln. You can tell the difference between a dime and a penny. Dimes and pennies are different colors. They're also different sizes. A dime is slightly smaller than a penny, but it is worth more. Don't forget that, that's 10 cents. And the pictures are going to be different too. Even though they both have presidents, on the back, a dime has a torch, and a penny has a picture of the Lincoln Memorial. Let's look at the number 43. It looks like one of our place value charts. 43 has four tens and three ones. We can even use our place value blocks to show four tens and three ones. I'm going to count that. When we count by tens, we count 10, 20, 30, 40. We ended right there. Now we count the ones. 41, 42, 43. A dime is just like those 10 sticks. They're both worth 10. Pennies are worth one cent. And they're just like the yellow blocks over there. If I was to count by tens, I would count the coins like this. 10, 20, 30, 40, 41, 42, 43. Our answer is 43 cents. Now we're going to look at the number 16. Here's what 16 looks like in place value blocks. If we were going to use dimes and pennies, because they are also tens and ones, it would look like this. One dime, that's 10, and six pennies. Let's count the coins. We're going to start with the dimes. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Our answer is 16 cents, and it's written just like this. In this piggy bank, there are some dimes and some pennies. Let's see how much money is in this piggy bank. The first thing I'm going to do is make sure that all of my dimes are together and all of my pennies. I only have one penny because they're at the end. Let's count by tens and ones in order to figure out how much money we have. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, that's all the dimes, and we have one penny, 51. In this piggy bank, we have 51 cents. Excellent job. All right, let's get ready for another piggy bank. We still have some tens and we still have some ones. All right, the first thing I like to do is I like to make sure that all of my pennies and my dimes are in order. I put my dimes first, and then I put my pennies. Let's count. 10, 20, that's all the dimes. We gotta switch, now we're counting by ones. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. We have 27 cents in this bank. You have more practice with counting dimes and pennies. Thanks so much, and we'll see you here tomorrow. Bye!